Hi, in this video we will see OS module in Node.js. So we are going to take a look at some of the options that OS module offers us. Okay, so make sure that you have Node.js installed and now open one text editor and save the file with name sample.js. First thing you should do, create one variable name OS and call for module OS. Okay, after that, type in console.log and first thing we are going to do is find temp directory okay so I'm going to use os dot temp dir okay and I'm going to check on console how it works node sample.js is the command your file name could be different Okay, so it will show you this temp dir is not function because I use e. I just have to use tmp dir. Okay, so let's go again. And here we will find temporary directory on Windows, which in my case is with this path. The next thing I want to print out, let's say, host name. Okay, so I'm going to type in console.log host name and the next thing should be os dot host name. Okay, can comment this part out and only execute the current code. And here you will find name of your machine. In my case, it's Devnami. Okay, now let me comment this part. And next, I want to print out is OS type. So I'm going to use console.log, then OS type, and then I'm going to use plus OS.type method. Okay, now let's execute this. And it says double OS is not defined. That means I have one more typo. Sorry for that. And as you can see, it shows Windows empty as OS type. Okay, so the correct version, which is Windows 7, is not shown by Node.js module. That's all right. We will go ahead with next option now type in console.log and here we will check os platform so whether it is 32 bit or 64 we will find that out so type in os.platform and this method should show you that okay so Let's check out that and it will show you Win32. Okay, so after that, we will also take a look at architecture. So in case of Linux, that would be interesting output to check. Let's check out for Windows. Type in os.arg and print this out. Open command prompt and it will show you x64. Okay, so this is interesting that when you check for platform, it will show you Win32. However, when you check for architecture, it will show you supported CPU architecture, which is x64. So that's one difference that I have found. So these are five examples of OS module that you can use with Node.js. There are plenty of others that you can use for finding out network address, CPU, number of CPUs on your system, and CPU information. So this was a short video on how to use OS module in Node.js.